TFNN Headline News Update. Here's Tom O'Brien. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in Clearwater, Florida, 4 p.m. Eastern Time on Friday, wrapping up the trading week and markets ending the session at basically session highs. Quite a week for the markets overall. Dow Jones up 71 points at the close, trading 25,314. S&P's up seven points, trading at 27.79. And the NASDAQ positive by 10 points, trading at 76.45. That's after all the indices being in the red coming into the opening bell, but it's been quite a day. Let's jump over to the Nadex platform and check in on some of those futures markets as we wrap up the trading week. We'll start things off with the Dow 30, so it's a one-way rocket ship to the upside. Early in the session, seven early pre-market session, 7 a.m., we're trading at about 25,100. We're now a solid 110 points below that level. Even going from the market open, which was much closer to about 25,200, still the Dow climbs about 113 points today, currently trading 25,312. NASDAQ 100, pretty similar story. Early pre-market, trading approaching 7,080. Around the opening bell, we're trading down there at about 71.10. And throughout the day, we rise another 40 points, 71.51, trading and ending the session near highs. S&P 500, much of the same. One-way rocket ship to the upside. Early pre-market, lows of about 27.56. We're now over 20 points above that level. S&P's trading 27.78 as we speak. Crude with some volatility at about 10.30 a.m. this morning. Crude trading at 66.20. Fast forward a half hour from there, and we're a dollar lower at 65.20. And from there, we reclaimed some of those losses in the crude contract, ending the week 65.63 in that July futures contract. Gold contract with a pretty tight trading range for the day, almost really $1 since about 7 a.m. Gold flirting between 13.02 and 13.03, pretty much the upper bound, ending the trading session 13.02.63 currently. And Bitcoin with a little bit of volatility as well. We saw a few spikes, but you're only talking about $50, maybe $100 in the price of Bitcoin as it fluctuates. Pretty relatively calm week in cryptocurrencies. Started the week around 77, excuse me, 7,700 in Bitcoin, and we ended at 7,640. Thanks so much, folks. Have a great weekend. Have a safe weekend. We look forward to seeing you back here Monday morning, live, 9 a.m. for programming at TFNN.com. Have a great one, folks.